My dear friend in Christ, have you ever noticed that the people whom we often regarded as good sometimes turn out to be bad and the people whom we often regarded bad sometimes turn out to be good but this is the fact of life because there's something good in the worst of us and something bad in the best of us there is an old story of a grandfather who was talking to his little grandson about a fight that goes on in the lives of each one of us there is a fight that is going on inside each one of us it is a terrible fight and it is a fight between two wolves one is evil and that is anger envy sorrow regret greed arrogance self pity guilt resentment inferiority lies false pride superiority and egocentricness and among these many other evil things and then the grandfather continued to tell the story and he said the other is the good wolf and that good wolf he is joy he is peace he is love he is hope he is serenity he is humility he is kindness he is benevolence he is empathy he is generosity truth compassion faith and whatever you may add yes my friend in christ there are two wolves in each one of us and the same fight is going on in each one of us the fight between the two wolves and the grandson looking at the grandpa asked and uh, who wins finally which wolf wins grandpa and the grandpa kissed his little grandson and he said you want to know which wolf wins at the end though there are two wolves inside you and the little boy looked at his grandfather with eager longing eyes and said which wolf will win and the grandpa once again kissed his grandson and he said the wolf that you feed most will win so if you feed the bad wolf the bad wolf will win if you feed the good wolf the good wolf will win my dear friend in christ we are all good each one of us but we always face a conflict of good and evil we are sometimes good too good sometimes bad too bad even if others don't pass such remarks against us we know it in ourselves in his letter to the romans chapter 12 st paul presents us with a beautiful way of living in harmony with ourselves with god and with one another in this chapter chapter 12 he helps us understand that we all have the potential of being evil or being good but he urges us to let the good in us to triumph over everything that makes us evil and i leave you with verse 21 of chapter 12 though you may like to read the whole chapter chapter 12 verse 21 do not be overcome by evil but overcome evil with good may you have a good and godly day